Welcome to my channel, Connection of Lives and Interests. This is Sharon and Mr. Thumbs Up. He's playing it out as he goes along. And when you do the chain, it's easy to go in the slot, but it's hard to come out of the slot when you want to disconnect that chain right here. I spent six hours getting the chain off one time. How it went in so easy. Could clip? Yeah, so I'm wondering if, if, if I film it, you'll be able to see how you did it for next time. Very uncomfortable situation. Just shut it off. The transmission bolts got to be removed. So I can actually remove the transmission bolts and let the jack do its job under there. because the transmission is mounted that way. So of course, when it comes forward, it's gonna be great. There's no lifting involved for the transmission to have to come up. If these were side mounts, it would be so much easier. But now I have to get these out, but hold pressure on this, but it's pulling this forward. All right. So he thought about taking this out, but then he'd have to take this out, and a lot of people take... No, I just wanted to take this out. Oh, okay. But I can't get it out without taking this off. Right. Because this will not fit. <clears throat> it will not come out. It'll right. hit. I can't clear. Right. Oh, maybe I can. This is up here. This goes... Everything will go forward. This is straight line. That's straight line. Okay. Let me look at this again. He's figuring it out as he goes. Yeah. Yep, yeah, it'll come out. So the only issue is, is the fenders are still going to go out a little bit more. So when it's time to put it back together. You have to have two people hold the sides just push in. push and get a couple bolts in and then, you know, so. Yeah, that'll give me five more inches and uh, that's what we're going to do. So that's why it takes all day to do these things. If you don't know what you're doing. Yeah, play and learn. You know, it, it's like us that you know, do crafting and stuff. It wasn't that loud. I think it's louder going backwards than forwards. So no, my... we're not going backwards. <laughs> we're doing things. <laughs> No, I'm talking about that thing is more noisy going backwards than forwards. Oh, yeah, we're not going backwards. <laughs> so, do you think that if the fenders are pushed out, you'll still be able to move the car into the garage if you want? Oh, yeah, it's just kind of spraying a little yeah. bit. Yeah, go boing, boing, It's not going to go, whoa, <laughs> to the neighbor's house. Oh, like butterflies. All right, that's what we need. Okay, uh, so let's see. All the bolts are from the top. Welcome to my channel, no, Connection of Lives and Interests. This is Sharon and Mr. Thumbs Up. And I want to give a channel shout out. And uh, we want to thank Mr. and Mrs. Just Journaling with Possum Patty and Mr. Possum, who watches all of Mr. Thumbs Up's car projects on his TV. Thank you so much. We appreciate you. Please go check out their channel. Cause she has a lot of wonderful things that she shares. She does uh, journaling books. She collects things from nature outside in her yard and travels to create with natural things for her journaling. She did uh, a page of this 55 Chevy You've got to check that video. If I remember, I'll put that in the link below. She did a page and it was totally awesome how she had the, we, I had the garage door shut when we first got the car. And it says, um, reveal on that video. And it's a 55 Chevy, like opening door number one, door number two, door number three, but there's just one door. And out came the Chevy. So that's how we revealed the 
car to you and Possum yeah, Patty. Got some crazy noises coming out. Okay. Uh, Possum Patty totally. I, I don't. I don't even remember if I showed Mr. Thumbs Up. I'm gonna say sorry, Patty. I don't think I did, but I will. This is a reminder. It's just hard with him doing his stuff and me doing my stuff to remember to show him stuff. <laughs> stuff, stuff, stuff. So I hope you all are doing well. And remember when you do your projects, you have to bag and tag the parts and stick them where you need to stick them. And he has labeled everything. He's really good. He had to buy new masking tape to use because the other one was oh don't buy the one from dollar tree it's good for nothing we're still going forward but really slow <laughs> but uh yeah that one doesn't work good it just keeps breaking apart and it is probably maybe 8 30 in the morning and it's already getting hot out here i can't handle the heat so i'm doing good with the TMJ disorder, I have not been chewing food, so that's the big difference, and lots and lots of prayers, so thank you all that have been praying. And you can't get a job done until you have half of your tools out here on the driveway. <laughs> if you think you're just gonna have three or four tools, <laughs> no. <laughs> so I'm wondering if we're gonna get any people to stop. Then you gotta get something in your eye. Oh yeah, and get always. splinters. Can't wear your glasses. Sunburn, sweaty, sweat in your eyes. That protect yourself. Cussing. Oh yeah, we don't do that. Nope. We just say old oh, fudge or no, son we of a don't gun. Say any F words. <laughs> <laughs> so usually when he's out here doing stuff people like to stop by so you just never know it is a weekend so oh they're afraid to stop by now <laughs> see my neighbor left he's scared <laughs> yeah our neighbor jim he asked us how things were going and said oh sharon's out there and he left <laughs> it's like i'm out of here <laughs> um both of our neighbors. So I gotta get 18 inches of the Z Bart undercoating off, which is a good thing. <laughs> but yeah, the neighbors on each side helped um, put that lighthouse top up. Well, and move it out here too. So you might want to check that playlist for the lighthouse that was built by this man right here. And we have a 10 by 20 cabin also. So if you're new here, check out those playlists. We have him building it all. Yeah, but the lighthouse, I think I was on anesthesia because I don't remember. <laughs> the lighthouse or the cabin? The cabin, you were like, you can't believe you did it. Oh, I thought I bought that. <laughs> yeah, and there was a lookalike guy in the video. The monster in the woods? The monster in the woods. Oh, uh, let's see. One more. We got it. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, ninety-five bolts. Okay, so we're gonna stop this video here, and we're just gonna keep doing parts of this journey of taking it all apart, so he can get the engine out with the engine hoist. We hope you'll give us a thumbs up. We oh, hope is that what we're supposed to do? <laughs> <laughs> we hope oh, you join our me. channel. Help me! And um, hit that bell. <laughs> like a baby trying to find stuff in the crib. <laughs> Found it. <coughs> Found I need, it, uh huh. I need to figure out. I won. I, I need to find out which um, sunscreen is best to protect you from cancer. Absolutely. I know there's one ingredient that they've one. added um, some years back. But. We're not ones to wear sunscreen, but he needs to. As you know, he's had get under the car. skin cancer removed from his left side of his temple oh, seven, and his six. right ear. And he goes back in December to have some, some procedure to prevent all the spots that they froze off 
from turning into cancer. They want to do that in the winter because they know that he always works out in the heat. <laughs> he does not like to sit in his recliner. And then he might have another surgery in the fall. So that would lay him up again too. But at least he'll get his fill because it's only June 22nd or 23rd, whatever Sunday it is. All right, be kind, be nice, be encouraging no matter where you are through the internet. We can touch uh, lives, we can make a difference. I need my phone. Oh, and we can um, touch lives, make a difference. Where did you put it? Probably on the workbench. Workbench, okay. Right. Um, touch people's lives, make a difference no matter where we are through the internet. Be kind, I already said that. Okay, so here we go. He's gonna watch videos. That's what we do. So I hope you have helpful car videos that you can share with us. Thanks for watching. It's not a big deal, but I don't need it. <laughs> I really don't. I mean. Okay.